हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू ए न्यू सेशन ऑफ मीनोपास ए नाइट मेयर और सुलेस मीनोपास इज थिकर देन वाटर वेन वी टॉक एंड लाफ अबाउट इट वी लर्न एंड रिलैक्स इट्स लाइफ ट्रांजिशन नॉट ए डिजीज I am Dr. Jagajit Singh Virk, MBBS, FCGP, FAMS, PGDGM. Why does menopause occur? Menopause is a natural process that occurs as the ovaries age and produce less reproductive hormones. The body begins to undergo several changes in response to lower levels of estrogen progesterone testosterone follicle stimulating hormone luteinizing hormone one of the most notable changes is the loss of active ovarian follicles ovarian follicles are the structures that produce and release eggs from the ovary wall allowing menstruation and fertility most women first notice the frequency of their period becoming less consistent as the flow becomes heavier and longer this usually occurs at some point in the mid to late 40s by the age of 52 most us women have undergone menopause in some cases menopause is induced or caused by injury or surgical removal of the ovaries and related pelvic structures menopausal transition menopause is a point in time 12 months after a woman's last period the years leading up to that point when women may have changes in their monthly cycles hot flashes or other symptoms are called the menopausal transition or perimenopause the men menopausal transition most often begins between ages 45 and 55 it usually lasts about 7 years but can be as long as 14 years the duration can depend on lifestyle factors such as smoking age it begins and race and ethnicity during perimenopause the body's production of estrogen and progesterone two hormones made by the ovaries varies greatly the menopausal transition affects each woman uniquely and in various ways the body begins to use energy differently fat cells changes and women may gain weight more easily you may experience changes in your bone or heart health your body shape and composition or your physical function estrogen le hormone levels menopause occurs at the end of women's reproductive years and is marked by her last menstruation menstrual cycle or period the onset of menopause referred to as perimenopause or menopause transition usually begins around ages of 45 to 55 during this time a woman's menstrual cycle becomes less frequent and she begins to experience symptoms such as hair thinning hot flashes mood swings night sweats painful sex vaginal dryness and weight gain is it really menopause if you are having symptoms that are common during menopause your doctor may ask questions about your age symptoms and family history to determine if it really is the menopausal transition causing your problems in some cases your doctor may suggest a blood test to check your follicle stimulating hormone and estradiol levels to rule out any other causes for the changes you are experiencing 
while the menopausal transition may commonly be referred to as menopause true menopause doesn't happen until 1 year after a woman's final menstrual period for that reason a woman who does not want to get pregnant should continue to use birth control for at least a full 12 months after her last period menopause can also be triggered by a hysterectomy or surgical removal of the ovaries which produce hormones if you have surgery to remove your uterus or ovaries and are not taking hormones you will experience symptoms of menopause immediately post menopause after menopause women enter post menopause post menopausal women are more vulnerable to heart heart disease and osteoporosis during this time it is important to continue to eat a healthy diet be active and make sure you get enough calcium for optimal bone health change in periods this might be what you notice first your periods may no longer be regular they may be shorter or last longer you might bleed more or less than usual these are all normal changes but to make sure there isn't a problem see your doctor if your periods happen very close together you have heavy bleeding you have spotting your periods last more than a week your periods resume after no bleeding for more than a year hot flashes many women have hot flashes which can last for many years after menopause they may be related to changing estrogen levels levels a hot flash is a sudden feeling of heat in the upper part of all of your body your face and neck may become flushed red blotches may appear on your chest back and arms heavy sweating and cold shivering can follow hot flashes can be very mild or strong enough to wake you up that's called night sweats most hot flashes last between 30 seconds and 10 minutes they can happen several times an hour a few times a day or just once or twice a week bladder control a loss of bladder control is called incontinence you may have a sudden urge to urinate or urine may leak during exercise sneezing or laughing the first step in treating incontinence is to see a doctor bladder infections also can occur in midlife sleep problems around midlife some women start having trouble getting a good night sleep maybe you can't fall asleep easily or you wake too early night sweats might wake you up and if you wake up during the night you might have trouble falling back to sleep vaginal health and sexuality after menopause the vagina may become drier which can make sexual intercourse uncomfortable you may also find that your feelings about sex are changing you could be less interested or you could feel freer and sexier because after one full years without a period you can no longer become pregnant however you could still be at risk for sexually transmitted diseases such as gonorrhea or hiv aids your risk for an std increases if you have sex with more than one person or with someone who has sex with others if so make sure your partner uses a condom each time you have sex mood changes you might feel moodier or more irritable around the time of menopause scientists don't know why this happens it's possible that stress family changes such as growing children or aging parents a history of depression or feeling tired could be causing these mood changes talk with your primary care provider or a mental health professional about what you are experiencing there are treatments available available to help 
your body seems different your waist could be could get larger you could lose muscle and gain fat your skin could become thinner you might have memory problems and your joints and muscles could feel stiff and achy researchers are exploring such changes and how they relate to hormones and growing older for some women symptoms may include aches and pains heart attacks and heart palpitations face changes menopause causes many changes to your skin your body stops making as much collagen you lose some fat under your skin and your skin's elasticity drops that combined with the dryness caused by hormonal changes can cause sagging especially around the neck jawline and cheeks and fine lines and wrinkles can a woman have an orgasm after menopause orgasms and great sex are still absolutely possible through menopause and beyond a few small changes can go a long way towards increasing your pleasure during sex solo or partnered and boosting physical and emotional intimacy with your partner or partners does your urine smell during menopause menopause can also increase a woman's risk for urinary tract infections and ammonia smelling odor resulting from drops in the female hormone estrogen and loss of vaginal flora which are the normal and healthy bacteria living in the vagina both these changes may cause ammonia smelling urine how do they test for menopause sometimes elevated follicle stimulating hormone levels are measured to confirm menopause when a woman's follicle stimulating hormone blood level is consistently elevated to 30 ml unit per ml or higher and she has not had a menstrual period for a year it is generally accepted that she has reached menopause what fruit is good for menopause cooling foods if you are suffering from hot flashes so called cooling foods including apples bananas spinach broccoli eggs and green tea may help you cool down what stops hot flashes hot flashes and night sweats wearing light clothing keeping your bedroom cool at night taking a cool shower using a fan or having a cold drink trying to reduce your stress levels avoiding potential triggers such as spicy food caffeine smoking and alcohol taking regular exercise and losing weight if you are overweight how can i tighten my skin after menopause if sagging skin or wrinkles bother you protect your skin from the sun this can reduce visible wrinkles and prevent new wrinkles you will find other ways to treat wrinkles at wrinkle remedies consider using a skin care product that contains retinol or peptides these ingredients can increase collagen in your skin foods that worsen menopausal symptoms processed foods spicy foods fast foods alcohol caffeine and fatty meats all these are considered which are not good for menopausal symptom what vitamins help menopause menopause supplements the 10 best vitamins minerals and supplements to manage symptoms magnesium for many women in our menopause solutions facebook group magnesium particularly magnesium glycinate has been a game changer 320 mg per day vitamin a 750 microgram vitamin b6 and b12 1.5 mg of vitamin b6 
and 2.4 microgram of vitamin B12, vitamin K 90 microgram, vitamin C 75 milligram, calcium 1000 milligram to 1200 milligram, vitamin D 600 units, omega 3s 1100 milligram for women, probiotics, turmeric, curcumin 500 milligram twice a day. Lifestyle changes. Lifestyle changes help many women deal with menopausal symptoms. Try these steps. If you are having hot flashes, drink cold water. Sit or sleep near a fan and dress in layers. Use an over-the-counter vaginal moisturizer or lubricant for dryness. Exercise regularly to sleep better and prevent conditions like heart disease, diabetes, and osteoporosis. Strengthen your pelvic floor muscles with Kegel exercises to prevent bladder leaks. Stay socially and mentally active to prevent memory problems. Don't smoke. Tobacco might cause early menopause and increase hot flashes. Limit how much alcohol you drink to lower your chance of getting breast cancer and help you sleep better. Eat a variety of foods and keep a healthy weight to help with hot flashes. Practice things like yoga, deep breathing and massage to help you relax. Thank you very much.